What is up, everybody? You're all still here. We survived another end of days or Armageddon. We've been through a couple of those. Well, at least I have. What, you know, Y2K, 2000, you know, 2012, and you had COVID. I mean, and I'm sure I'm missing one or two, but we've had a few of those apocalypses, huh? Anyway, let's get to our boat ramp. Let's catch some mullets and um, <clears throat> see if we can't hook into something. We're gonna probably give it two, three hours and then home, head home and make sure we got everything taken care of tomorrow so I don't forget anything. So, uh, yeah, you never know what we'll get into. If you didn't see my video from yesterday, um, slow, slow day. I think it was a mix between the cold weather, the extremely low tide, and then a bunch of baby bull sharks that were up in the river. So, a mixture of all those things, I think, just really slowed down the bite but we did manage to hook into what I believe to be those uh, they're like small juvenile uh, bull sharks so that was a lot of fun so I didn't have my shark gloves with me because um, I wasn't expecting to be running into any sharks in the lagoon oh what the heck the boat ramp is busy busy um, I guess we'll park over here and then walk over and wait for them to leave maybe I'm not sure oh it's a little windy and it's all choppy maybe we should change our plan today okay let me show you so yeah cast netting mm, I don't know if that's gonna work this might be a bust everybody and there's already people fishing the whole thing so I guess I could drive around, look for a different spot, or uh, or do we go home and just get ready for tomorrow? And just scratch this whole video. Mm. <clears throat> well, I guess at the very least we can probably just, you know. Maybe at the very least we can uh, cast out a line and just <clears throat> hang out for a little bit. Ah. Yeah, so today isn't going so, isn't really going to plan. I was hoping for one of these cars to leave and then we could park over by where I want to, but uh, yeah, it's not happening. So. Uh, what should I do? It's pretty freaking windy. Screw it. You never know. Sometimes that wind, I got this big bull shark at this spot when it was super windy disabled. like this. So, all right, let's just give it a shot. I don't know if we're gonna be able to catch any mullet, but uh, hopefully the weather's not like this tomorrow. Recording. Three channels started. Oh my gosh. All right, all right guys. Let's see if we can get something. I'm not sure. Wish me luck. said as he made the turn on a detachable, here comes two jeeps with four SPs in each one.
Couldn't get more better than that. Got a shark. Yeah. Woo! Uh, probably a baby bull. They got black fish when they're little, but. Watch out. Alright, I just want to make sure no one's in the way here. Launches and sharks, doesn't get much better. For this? Yeah, yeah, I, 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 tr I go almost every weekday making videos. I watch them all the time. It's the first time I see you over here though. Oh yeah, I actually live close. So this is my, this is where I go when I want to just get kind of close. Oh, but you, you, you see my channel before? Oh, okay. Well, I appreciate it. Oh, cool. Thank you. I mean, I'm still working on it. I got a lot of work to do, you know. I'm still learning the whole fishing of Florida. It's your interesting watch. I know. At least I'm getting outside, right? <laughs> Sure. Say your, say your next thing, I know you are. Three channels started. What? I guess not. Okay. Wow. What an epic day. Recording. Three channels started. Anyway, what an epic day. Holy cow. It turned out, remember, I don't know if you just saw the beginning of this video. I'm sitting here going, oh, it's windy. Is this not? Should we even cast out a line? 
well super windy so we didn't do any cast editing and we don't have any mullet but I casted out my shark rig with some big old cut ladyfish and all I got was a, a big catfish and then out of nowhere people just started showing up and I met some really cool Marines one guy he was a jet pilot that they're all telling me all these stories about you know when the challenger and all these kind of things i'm like is there a launch going on and then the whole parking lot as you see here filled up with cars and i think it was a, there was the delta four heavy that was uh or delta four i'm not sure if it was the heavy or not i'll have to double check but that was taken off and the most florida thing could you know i mean it couldn't get more florida than this as the rocket is launching, seriously, it is only maybe a foot above the ground out there, and my reel starts going off. And there's people everywhere. <laughs> I'm fighting the shark, there's a rocket launch, a Delta IV rocket launch going off in front of me. Wow, like nowhere else in the world can you go where you could fish, catch sharks, and catch a rocket launch at the same time awesome well i had a whole crowd watching me get this shark out of the water um i didn't end up you know using pliers to get the hook out i ended up just cutting it i used uh hooks that'll rust out so that'll be gone he'll be fine i just less risk for me and less fish uh risk for the fish as well um if it's easy to get to you know you can usually pop that hook but there's just a lot of people around and I didn't want to risk, you know, it thrashing around any more than it was. So I ended up just cutting the hook. I kind of let everybody uh, kind of take a look at it. Uh, and uh, it, we gave it a proper release. But all in all, what a cool day. I met some amazing people and I heard some amazing stories from, from some, some fellow jarheads and some former NASA employees and people that uh that have just been around the aerospace industry uh for for many many years and uh they all came out to see the launch and i had a blast chatting with them but um like i said there's always an adventure there's always an adventure and that's why i do my videos it's a journal for me but it's also what i've learned is it, it helps motivate a lot of you all to get outside you never know what's going to happen. You're not going to make new adventures. You're not going to make new new memories unless you get outside. Get outside, enjoy it, and uh, make some new adventures like me. I did not even know there was a launch today. I just wanted to get outside and do a little fishing and look what happened. And if you watch my videos, that's kind of the trend. You never know what you're going to get into. You never know what you're going to see. But uh, anyway, everybody, I appreciate you guys all for watching and hanging out with me today. Um, not a bunch of fishing content except for the shark and the catfish, but we also saw a rocket launch and that's epic, epic, epic. So anyway, not sure. Maybe we'll get the kayak out tomorrow. Maybe we'll head down south. Maybe we'll head somewhere local. I got to check the weather report, but thanks for watching everybody. I'll catch you in the next one. Tight lines. Peace.